So let's talk about rental cars. If you guys want to know how you can save a lot of money, and I'm not getting paid to do this, but I'm going to tell you the service that our friends told us about that we're going to use every single time we travel to Europe moving forward. And the company is called Wise Cars. So what we did is we went to wisecars.com and we put in where we were going. We're going to go to Lisbon. So we needed a car to drive from Lisbon to Lagos. So we went to Wise Cars and the prices, we ended up paying $39 for a one-week rental, which I don't know what the math is, $6, $7 a day. No hidden fees. Sure, they put a hold on your credit card when you pick up the car as expected. All I had to do is make sure I had an international driver's license. So all you have to do is you go there and you type in where you want to go and it lists you a bunch of cars and you can't really care. I mean, you kind of pick the car you want, sort of, but they ended up hooking us up through a company called Car Wiz. So we go to Wise Cars to find the car and then the car supplier ended up being a company called Car Wiz. If you're traveling abroad and you want a rental car because sometimes you need it to drive from city to city, go and check that out. I'm going to be doing that moving forward. And again, I'm not getting paid to do this. Now, what I can say is the company Car Wiz that we ended up getting the car from, the communication wasn't the best on how to actually pick up the car. They send you instructions, but you want to call and be very specific. Okay, what specifically do we need to do? We didn't know that we needed to call them. When we got there, it just told us where to meet them. We were looking for them for 30, 45 minutes because they weren't located where all the other rental cars are. So we ended up calling them. They're like, oh, you're here. We'll be there in 15 minutes. So once we were able to establish that, they met us, took us to the car, did the same condition report you would normally do when you pick up a rental car anywhere else you go, and gave us the keys. That was that. The Hard Rocking Podcast, a little bit of cars, and so much more available anywhere you get your podcast or check it out at hardparkingpod.com.